All right, so we managed to get this from MDT. Uh, it's a bacon grease covered hot mess uh, of a barrel that they used for the thousand round and two hour torture test. Our intent is to clean the crap out of it and see if we can bring it back to life uh, with some hand loads and some factory ammo and a bunch of different stuff and really see if thousand rounds in two hours did kill it or not. As you can see, we're out in the Great White North now. We're going to shoot the MDT 1000 round gun. We're going to shoot some factory through it, and we're also going to shoot some hand loads through it that I kind of monkeyed around with just a little bit uh, to see if I can get it to shoot any less than uh, an inch after 1000 rounds in two hours. Let's give it a shot and see what happens. Is that a gratuitous slow motion case extraction shot? Okay, so it's looking pretty good. Pretty much what we figured it would be. So I fired three zero shots uh, after I put a couple into the snow. So I shot that one, then that one, then this one. Then that's our first group there. Five shots with uh, the factory S&B ammo, which is pretty good considering it's uh, under 40 bucks a box. Then I fired uh, uh, my buddy Alex's hand loads here, 139 grain center. Five shots in there. Then I shot uh, some 143 ELDXs over here. I shanked one, that was me, but still pretty good there. And then the final group up there is also uh, 143 ELDXs, uh, just at a slightly different seating depth with uh, H4350. So there you are. I think, uh, I think we know that the barrel can shoot. I thought about running some JB bore paste through the uh, bore, but quite frankly, I forgot. So. Uh, here we are. I think uh, still got lots of life in this barrel. Okay, so we figured out that that barrel shoots. Just needed a little TLC. Uh, shot the factory ammo good. Shot the hand loads really good. All done. And now we're ready for a little bit of a snack here. So you can join me if you want. I forgot the jerk chicken. <laughs> 